Hello there everyone, thank you so much for joining me today. My name is Gabe and today we're going to be doing another quick little Saturday show. I figured that we could do, you know, some more in-depth con uh, content on the Monday, Wednesday, Friday, and then on the Saturday stuff, just do the small things such as opening that little cereal pack, or uh, in this case, we're going to be doing a, uh, a bunch of uh, unboxings of uh, the Pokemon trading card game online. Uh, we're going to be doing a bunch of the packs. Uh, just I was able to get all of those code cards from all the stuff that I've been unboxing. I ended up putting them in uh, the other night and now I wanted to just open them up and show you guys what you can look forward to in those. So I'm going to go ahead and switch it on over. Here we are. And if you go into here, your collect, well, I'll show you first. Uh, the way I did it was you go into this, redeem codes, and then if you, you can enter the codes manually here or you can uh put a um webcam on and you can actually just pop your card right there it'll read it and it actually reads it from pretty far away so you can just kind of pop it up pop it up uh you can only do 10 at a time though that was the unfortunate part because i had 71 codes to get through so you have to do 10 at a time hit claim now and then go through them again so if you go up here to this button the second button right there go to collection and go to, over to packs. Uh, you can also see what I got. I got these two things from the Champion's Path ETB. I got the card sleeves and the card box. Also got the, from the Shining Fates, we got the EV back, uh, card sleeves and the EV deck. This is the Rapid Strike Urshifu ETB we got, the card uh, sleeves and deck. This was the um, sleeves from the Pokemon trainer toolkit set uh this is the one that just comes with all of them or when you make an account uh so yeah so if you go over to packs here um we can just unbox a bunch of these so let's do i figure we'll just go ahead and do some of this see what we can get i'm really trying to go for the um and as you can probably see, I don't have too many. Hey, nice. We got a holographic Snorlax. We are going to just open all of these. Because I need to bulk out my uh, Galarian Berserker. I need to bulk out my just compendium, basically. So that uh, I have stuff in my collection. Um, so that's why normally I would, you know, trade some stuff for these, but it's not really, I just don't have enough online here to do that. So, got a reverse hollow Snorlax and a Toxtricity, just a regular, um, non-holographic rare right there. That's very interesting. Charge a bug. Love Shuckle. Shuckle's so funny. Meditite. Roly Coley. Um, oh wait, no, that's not what I wanted to do. Um, so what I was saying was, I'm really looking to get a... Um, I want to fill out my Scorch deck online here so that I can play it. Because I'm planning on playing a Scorch deck. Um, we have a Galarian Mr. Rhyme, which is good. And we also have a Gyarados. Uh, and that's a holographic Gyarados, too. That's pretty... That's really sexy looking. <clears throat> um, that's a that's a pretty good card right there. That can wreak some havoc with that. It's a lot of energy. It's two water energy and three colorless. But it does 200 damage and you discard any stadium in play, which can really um, mess up like an Eternit... Uh, yeah, the Eternatus... Um, which we call it's more Peko, Sandy Gast. Got a bunch of these ones already. Uh, darn it! How many times am I gonna do? That? <laughs> um, so yeah, so I'm, I'm I'm running right now a Center Scorch um, deck, and I really want Aegis Slash. Very cool. We don't have that one. Palpitoad. It's pretty cool. Um. 
And when, you know, when, when tournaments actually happen again, I'll be running a Scent of Scorch deck and a Mad Party deck. And so I want to get them in here so that I can uh, go ahead and practice with them, right? Makes sense. A Digger's Bee, and that evolves from a Bunnel Bee. That's pretty cool. I didn't know that Bunnel Bee had an evolution. Um, training Court. Once during each player's turn, that player may put a basic energy card from their discard pile into their hand. Interesting. Uh, let's open another. Reverse Hollow Trevenant. Trevenant. And a Whiskash. I've never heard of either of these two. That's pretty cool. Earthquake. Uh, okay, so that'll do 20 damage to each of your bench Pokemon as well. This one can be really good if you don't want them to retreat. Um, i trying to think of... Because right now, you want a lot of mobility in your decks. That's just kind of the meta right now, so... Um, if you have it where they're not going to retreat, that can be potentially really, really powerful. A nugget. Just a little nugget. Uh, get more? We actually are not going to do that. We are going to go back to here. And go to packs. And just keep on... We're not going to open the battle styles yet, because that's the most recent one. Um... From that one, I believe. Specifically, the Mad Party. Because, yeah, I'd like to run the Mad Party as well on this. Hey, we got a holographic Cinder Race. Um, yeah. Oh, look at that! A little Pinchino! It's so cute! I would love to have that one. Uh, real life. There's Hollow Codeine and a Cloister. Did not know that was in this deck. That's funny. Cloister is just very funny. Um, these really are not good. The Score Bunny, Raboot, and Cinderace are just... You, it's really hard to do two evolutions and have it viable right now. Let's see. Yep, there's our Zigzagoon. Sunfist. That looks just awful. <laughs> hey, more Peko. Very nice. Attack the wound. If your opponent's active Pokemon already has any damage counters on it, this attack does 50 more damage. That's interesting. Uh, oh, we had a Pokemon in there. Or a Pikachu in there. Oh, look at that! These ones are so interesting, the crocheted ones, with the knitted ones, whatever these are. Uh, what else we got? Fly Sharp, Switch, Sea King. Oh, We do not have one of those. Stonejourner V. Uh, guard press during the opponent's next turn. This Pokemon takes 20 less damage from attacks. That's not terrible. And then Mega... That's not real. I don't know. I'd have to see what the evolution for that is. Alright, two Sun and Moon Burning Shadows. Let's see. Stop it. We have one of those. Hey! A uh, Ho-Oh GX. Wow. This is a really good looking card. This is actually really nice. I really like this. Um, I wish I had this one. I wish I had this uh, as an actual card. So this is 190 HP. Sacred Fire. This attack does 50 damage to one of your opponent's Pokemon. Uh, for one fire and two colorless. For three fire and one colorless, you do Phoenix Burn for 180, and you can't use that on the next turn. And then you have Eternal Flame GX, which is the same as Sacred Fire. Put three in any combination of Fire Pokemon GX or Fire Pokemon EX from your discard pile onto your bench. 
Wow, that's very good. Potentially, that has the, yeah. With the mobility, that has a lot of potential for, you know, your, your really good card gets knocked out. Put that right back in there. Uh, take that, but again, you gotta think about how many turns that is gonna take. So that, may, I mean, that, you know, it's interesting. Um, these are cute little cards. All right. I feel like my gain is up really high on this. Is this any better? Is this any better? I don't know. I'll have to fix it next time, probably. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think this looks good. I'm looking at the things over here and not paying attention. We got an Alolan Muck GX. And I think we actually have that one. Yeah, we do. But this one, we don't have this one. We have, um... oh heck, hold on. What do we have? Let's get the binder out. We have Yeah, it's the Alolan Muck GX, but it is hold on. Let's see. So this is what this one looks like on the screen there. The one that we have is Whoop. Oh, almost bent that. Wow, that is terrible. You cannot. There, yeah, that's a little better. Uh, is this one? So it's different, different card basically. This one is. Um, Eighty-four. And this one is one thirty-eight. So card in the series. So. Anyway, that's kind of neat. Two different ones. I don't know which I like. I think I like the one that we got better, although are they the same thing? Chemical Breath and Crunch? Yeah, they're the same thing. Try Hazard. Um, just a, I don't, I, it, that one must be a full art version of it. Um, I don't know. I kind of like the one that we got, honestly, uh, in real life. I think that one just looks better. Big old four inch binder here. All right. All right. What else did we get? We got a uh, Mudbray, a Stuffle, Duskull. Yeah. All right. Let's open this one Sun and Moon. Although this one is. I believe no longer in standard for this upcoming year. You have to do uh interesting Palo Sand. Ratatat, Rowlet, Gross, Steeny. Look at that though. Look at the reverse hollow on that. I love these ones as opposed to the others. The newer ones. Uh, let's see here. What else do we got? We have a Sarina. That's pretty cool. Passimian. All right. Double colorless. That's very, very useful. Always love to see those. A drowsy. Um, uh, okay. Yeah, the, uh... Shining Fate. We only have three more? What the heck? I mean, we've got 22. Four. Yeah, we've got a lot of them, but we only have three more uh, things. Uh, let's do Champion's Path first. And what was I going to say? Oh, yeah. Sun and Moon base set isn't with the current uh, Witch Metal anymore. You have to get the first Hollow Energy. That's the first one I've gotten. Glarian Obstagoon. whoop de doop de doo Hop. Uh, I really want to get a hop, uh, full art, real life. 
IRL, as they say. Nice trubbish. Um, yeah, Sun and Moon, I think it is Tag Team. Sun and Moon Tag Team are the only two that you can play now. Dreadnought V, we do not have this one. This is the... Full Art? No, do we have the Full I don't know. I'm not going to look again at what we have. We have one similar to this, but it's actually like coming at you instead of just standing up, I think. Uh, Hatterene. Cool. Rotom Bike. Do we need that one? I don't think we need that one for the build we're doing. I love the Sizzlypede. All right. Let's see here. Kuna. Is that? Oh, an Altaria. Okay. Okie dokie. Um, yeah, let's keep on just, like I said, just pop and do these. Honestly, not a lot of these are going to be used. Just got that one. And the Swablu. Don't need these two. <laughs> We, we need our cards that we're not getting. How many of these Swablu? We've got like three of these Swablu's. Galarian Cursola V. Cool. I have a feeling... A Zygarde. Holographic, that's... That's sick. That looks awesome. That's really cool. I like that a lot. Um, yeah, nothing, nothing really cool there. We really need some stuff for this deck, man. Yep, my champion's path right there. Put an energy card. Life hard. Um, Omar, Great Ball, Great Ball will need, I think. Hey, Lucario V. I love Lucario. Who doesn't love Lucario? He's so cool. He's so cool. Ooh, nice. Reverse hollow. Uh, a gold or a yellow in there. Stupid Galarian Obstagoon. Carvana. Yeah, so the, um, whatchamacallit, the Scent Scorch deck that I'm looking for on here has a whole bunch of different series, different, uh, hey, there's a Scent Scorch. Too bad we need the Scent Scorch. I mean, um, yeah, I don't think that we use just a regular Scent Scorch. We need the Scent Scorch V and Scent Scorch V Max to actually do it, but that is a, Holographic Scorch, so that's pretty cool. Um, wow, man. Even on here, you get crummy crap. <laughs> Lycanroc, Holographic. There's Volpix up there. Um, what I was saying was different. We uh, there, The Centiscorch VMAX, uh, V and VMAX that we're running, um, have di are from different series so there's some from i think there's some from champions path shining fates and battle styles i think that there are a couple from battle styles um and then even back i want to say to sun and moon there is a there's a there's a, a card or two in there that you need four of um i can't remember exactly which one it is but this is a holographic machamp uh sent to scorch here Reverse Hollow, so that's kind of cool. Sharpedo, Piers. Piers is so cool. Hatrim. Hatina. We have the uh, Hatterene. Another Roly Coley from this one. Kabu. And hey, we got a Marnie. Always fun to have Marnie. <clears throat> really disrupts play. And a Reverse Hollow Suspicious Food Tin. I think this might be the last one of this. Ooh, we got an Arbok. Ooh. And a holographic Lycan Rock, reverse hollow Rotom bike, and a regular Rotom bike. Okay, 
this is the one that I'm most excited for. I love the Shining Fates. I've really had a good time opening these. We have 22 packs to open here. Hey! This is perfect. This is one of the ones we actually needed. This is a Dedenny. It's actually a Shiny Vault Den Dedenny. And it's the Mad Party set. So that's perfect. What's this one? Gym Trainer. This is a full art Gym Trainer. Draw two cards. If any of your Pokemon were knocked out during your opponent's last two car or last turn, draw two more cards. That's a pretty good card right there. Um, it's actually, in my opinion, a very good card. Uh, also, it's a full art, so that's really, really cool. We also have this Eldegoss, which is not what we need right now. We need the Eldegoss V, I think. That's the one we need. <clears throat> Which you could get from the... Um... What's that pack? Hey, a boss's orders. That's great. Um, Snom. What, what was I just saying? What was I just talking about? I don't know. I have to <clears throat> keep my train of thought sometimes. Dreadnought, we actually have this card. I think we have two of these. Uh, more Pekka, more Pico, whatever. Spinarak, Rusted Sword. Dartrix. Um, oh, uh, the Eldegoss, the Eldegoss V. You can get a tin with that one. So. A Professor's Research here, just regular. And a Luxray Reverse Hollow. I do like the yellow, the the electric energy, uh, reverse hollows, but for everything else, I like the uh, previous gen, previous um, series, of the sun and moon ones. Another Elder God. <laughs> hey, boom! That is exactly what we need right there. That's a really good looking card too. That is a. Um, Shiny Vault, Centiscorch VMAX. So we actually have this very card uh, in real life as well. So I will be using this card in real life. Uh, when when uh, the, the Witch McCalls come back, this card is going to be used. And that's really exciting that this, uh, yeah, that we got this in here as well. Uh, yeah, so this is 320 HP. It does, uh, for two colorless, G-Max Centiferno, 40 plus. This attack does 40 more damage for each fire energy attached to this Pokemon. If you did any damage with uh, this attack, you may attach a fire energy card from your discard pile to this Pokemon. So you just ramp and ramp and ramp, and it absolutely kills your, your opponent. It's really fun. Got another of these Dreadnaws. Um, cool. Very happy with that. That's the first one. We need three of those. Hey, we got a Yamper. This is another um, Shiny Vault one. And this is a Bird Keeper, full art. I really like this one. Um, I would love to have the. I don't know how viable it is. Switch your active Pokemon with one of your bench Pokemon. If you do, draw three cards. So it's actually pretty good at mobility. Um, and uh, pulling so yeah, so I would I would absolutely um, Potentially have this in my deck if I needed it um, Or if I was making a deck I Just love the artwork and I think this card in general is a really nice card to have uh, it's a nice full art um, What else do we have here nothing really exciting? Oh, we got an Eevee finally and hey the reverse hollow cute font the professor's research so yeah so we need two more of the center scorch v maxes and three we got a dub wool v and a mana fee um two v maxes three center scorch v's to have a set that is viable we got the cramorant there first hollow rowlet and a more peko v max 300 HP 
For two electric and one colorless, you do 180 damage. It says this attack also does 20 damage to each of your opponent's benched Pokemon. This can be a really good card um, if you are running uh, a deck that uh, pulls a lot of um, basic Pokemon out of your opponent's discard pile. If you can do that and put them on the bench, then you use that and just pound it pound it pound it you're gonna be doing you know a couple turns you can do some really really good damage there another reverse hollow q font and a professor's research yeah look at that it just doesn't even look like it's reverse hollow also as you can see some of these are some of these are the green packs and some of these are the white packs This one is just a basic Zerud. Um, if you want to know what the difference is on the back here, you can see this is a green card, and then this is what a white card looks like. These two different cards. And the white, whoop, the white card is what you want because the white card guarantees basically that it's going to be a really good pack you're going to have a, a holographic or something in there that's really good uh here's a reverse hollow eevee which is cool nothing else really I think we only have three more of these which is crazy that we've opened so many so fast choodle reverse hollow gossifler and a holographic decidui let's see here Another Reverse Hollow Gossifler and a Galarian Weezing, and that is a Holographic. That's actually a really pretty cool card. I love the top hats there, and also how it makes it look like a uh, chimney stack. That's pretty pretty cool. Uh, neutralizing Gas. As long as this Pokemon is in the active spot, your opponent's Pokemon in play have no abilities except for Neutralizing Gas. Huh. Okie dokie. Oh no, we have seven more of these. Alright, got a Morpeko there where he's stealing something. Camerant Reverse Hollow and a Yon Mega. Come on, man, fingers crossed. We need some more. I keep hitting this. This is my first time with this uh, setup here. We got a Celebi. And the Reverse Hollow Eldegoss, regular Eldegoss. I am going to try to, I don't know if, uh, when, so this will come out Saturday the 8th. Um, the Arrested Sword Reverse Hollow and a Skyla. Oh my goodness, this is one of my, like, major, major pull cards. I really, really want an in-person Skyla. This is such a good-looking card with... The, the sky in the background. Her character model is super cool. I really dig Skyla. Search your deck for a trainer card, reveal it, and put it in your hand, then shuffle your deck. It's a terrible, it's a terrible, like, supporter card, because there are a lot of items that can do this, but the, the artwork is cool, so, you know. Um, yeah, so this is going to go up on the 8th, so, like I said, this is my first time uh, doing this one. Um, Rillaboom, Holographic, Reverse Hollow Gym Trainer. I, I do these videos between like a week out and three weeks out, just depending. There's nothing in this pack. Um, and so, yeah, this is like my first time with this setup. I got an arm here and everything. And that was pretty cool. Oh my, look at that. Rillaboom V. And that's a shiny vault, Rillaboom V. That is 220 damage. Forest Feast, one uh, grass energy. Search your deck for up to two basic grass Pokemon. Put them onto your bench, then shuffle your deck. Three grass, one colorless. You get a wood hammer, 220 damage. And this Pokemon also does 30 damage to itself. We also got another holographic glaring wheezing. So what I was saying was, um, I don't know if this is going to be old news at this point or not, but um, by Saturday, hey, a holographic Indeedee and a reverse holo Snom. I don't know if this will be old news by the time I end up getting this out on Saturday, but I'm hoping to get an Eldegoss, a 
Whoa! Okay, now we have two more Peko V Maxes. And uh, we got this Cramorant, which is cool. <laughs> Shiny Vault! Yay, Cramorant. We already know what this one does. Um, we're done with that. What I'm going to try to get are the tins. I really want the tins um, with the Eldegoss, the Boltund, and the Cramorant Vs in them. I really want those. A Salazzle. We also got a bunch of good stuff in here. This one's a really... I want those. Um... Yeah, I don't know what I'm going to be getting. Tapu Bulu! And a Primeape. Bufalant, Urn of Vitality, Gligar, Ball Toy, Electrobuzz, Hone Edge, Tepig. We already have a Tepig. Uh, Bruxish. Cool. Yeah, they're, they're kind of hard to find at this point. So, gotta, gotta work for them. Steelix evolves from Onyx. That's pretty cool. 190 damage. That's not bad, honestly, for just a regular Pokemon. And then uh, five, three metal and two colorless heavy impact 200 with no uh, like um, damage to itself or damage to benched Pokemon. That's pretty good, actually. Cacnea, Weeping Bell. We got a Phoebe right there. Also, I love her outfit. It's so cute. Just that very, very flowy. Um, Haunch Crew, which evolves from a Murkrow. Roly Coley, Slandit, Corfish, Glarian Slowpoke, yes! Alright, uh, okay. Cherubai, Pachirisu, Ooh, don't have that one. A heap more, kind of cool. Cheryl! You know we got those Cheryl cards, we love Cheryl. A Crawdaunt, Reverse Hollow, and a Stone Journer, which was, and that's a single strike. That was the first big card we got, wasn't it? The Stone Journer V? I don't, I don't remember. Cool Jammer, Licky Tongue, Reverse Hollow. Mind Shao, interesting. Rapid Strike Mind Shao. Uh, Per Ugly, Mankey, Horsey. Couple more of these to open. Got a Houndour, Frillish, Silly Cobra, Tepig, Clam Meow, do more. Ooh, Mawile, Single Strike Mawile. And a Cherim, Holographic. Very cool. Aegislash. All right, cool. Uh, Buy Sharp, Energy Recycler, I like this. Uh, this is a, a good card. Murkrow, Licky Tongue. Uh, we got a Durant, a Girder, a Glary, Mr. Mime. Blitbug. We got a Salazzle, okay. Got five more packs after this one. We got a single strike energy there. Single strike scroll of scur scorn. Shanks. Paul Ponyard. That's crazy. This is our first Shanks. Um, we got a Galarian Mr. Rhyme. Reverse hollow. And a Mind Shao. Again. <laughs> Oh, those are kind of cool. Uh, this is a uh, Bruno, and we also got a Bronzong Reverse Hollow Rare. Uh, this evolves from Bronzor, and we also got a Centiscorch. Nice. Uh, unfortunately, again, like I said, I don't believe this is in the Centiscorch deck that I want to use, and I can show you guys here in just a second what that deck is. What is this? An Embor. Primeape. Galarian. Mr. Mime. 
cool. All right. Not looking too good right now. Ooh, this one's cool. A charcoal, reverse hollow, and a clay doll. We didn't get a single Santa Scorch V. We got a couple V. Or we got the one V Max. Salazzle and a Scatterbug. Reverse Hollow. Level Ball. I think. Uh, no, we don't want the level balls. Mind Fu. Uh, we only have one more. A Licky Licky. Reverse hollow cherubai. Okay. Timber. Alright. Let's see if I can. Hold on. I'm gonna put that there. Do this here. And I will. Let's see. Send a scorch. And. If I do the. That. Yep. There we go. So you can see here, this is the Santa Scorch VMAX deck that we're looking at. And we need three Santa Scorch Vs and three Santa Scorch VMAXs. Um, need some Dedeni uh, GXs. The Jirachis are what we needed. We really needed some Jirachis. Um, we did not get a Cramorant V or a Crobat. We did get the Zigzagoon. We can't get away from the Zigzagoons. Um, no Volcanion. Oh, we might have one Volcanion, actually. We didn't get it, but we might have a Volcanion. No Eldegoss V. That's for uh, mobility there and, and drawing cards and whatnot. Um... Let's see. We need, we've got a bunch of these. So actually we can put together part of the thing if you guys want to real quick. I know this is getting to be kind of a long video, but why not? We'll just see what we've got so far. So if we do collection, that's not what we want. We want to go to deck manager and create a new deck we want to do a standard deck here i'm going to put this over on this side here oh man i can barely see that hold on okay there we go i want so i can see the list here all right so you should be yeah you can see this okay we need the cramorant so i'm just going to do searches we need a Cramorant V, which we don't have. We have a Crobat V, which we don't have, I don't believe. No, we don't even have any of those. Uh, Galarian Zig. Okay, which one do we need? Windshield 117. So we need this one. We need one of them. Add. Oh no. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Do I add that? No. Okay. So we only needed one of those. Glaring zigs again. Uh, let's do the Santa Scorch. We got so many Santa Scorches here. But we need the Santa Scorch V Max. Uh, I don't believe we have the Heatran. Yeah, no. Um, I don't think we have... Nope. No Santa Scorch. I don't believe we have an Eldegoss V. No. Uh, what kind of Dedeni? What's our Dedeni situation? We need Dedeni GX. I think it's this one. 95A. Yeah, the dead A change. This card, your hand, and draw six cards. Yeah, so we need two of these. We're going to be dead A changing. Two of those. 
And I don't think we have a Jirachi, no. Do we have a Giratina? No. How about our trainer cards? We need oops, Pokemon communication. What? How do we not have commu Or is it just because I don't have any, uh, an excellent? Are you kidding? Oh, am I only in? That's right. I'm like, are you kidding me? Pokemon communication. So I need three of those. I only have two right now. In real life, we have a bunch. Uh, switch. We need. We need just like an actual switch. Switch. We want. this matters actually yeah so I'm just gonna add well, that so we got that we need our giant hearth Two of those. We actually need three, but we'll make do for now. Welder, we need to add those. Uh, we need four welders. Um, reset stamps. We need two of these. And what else do we need? Quick ball. We need four quick balls. We have three. We need a fire crystal. Oh, I don't know if we even have one of those. Oh, we do. Awesome. We only need one fire crystal? Interesting. Scoop up net. Oh, we don't have any scoop nets. Okay. Uh, I know we have a professor's research. One do we want? Um, we'll go with this one. Might as well. One professor's research. One great catcher. No, I didn't think we had one of those. Let's see. Which one do we need? 154. Which one of your... So we need two of those. Um, okay. And then we need 12 fire energies. Uh, we'll just do this. Okay. So far we have 35 so we're missing 25 cards for this deck to be complete so need some of those centiscorch v maxes we need some of the centiscorch v's i am sure that we'll get them let's save this though for now uh save deck Save this under, what do we want to save it under? We'll do this one because I like it. And that one. That one. Because that one's cool. Uh, your deck is currently invalid. No, I know it's invalid, but like. Yeah. Oh, I know it's invalid, but. <laughs> but I still need it. I don't want to have to do all that again. Um, cool. So, yeah. So, that's the. Uh, that's the thing I'm building right now. That's the that one. I'm also looking for the Mad Party stuff. Uh, hopefully I'll get that here, you know, relatively soon as well. Because right now, a little difficult to play in person. So this is kind of fun to play online. As you can see, I've basically just been playing the theme decks, really, you know. Um, but yeah, that's that. 
glad to have uh, have these cards in there. Now I can get rid of all of this giant stack here. Um, yeah. So yeah, so that is it. That is what you can look forward to if you have a bunch of these. Like I said, that was 71 uh, code cards there. Um, you can look forward to unpacking those. That's how you do it uh, and, and kind of what you can look forward to maybe getting. So yeah, let me know what you guys think. I um, put back on my full webcam now. Uh, yeah, this is just a little Saturday thing. I know it's gone on for way longer. It's a 45 minute plus video at this point. So <laughs> about, about time to be done with this, but, uh, I appreciate you watching, um, and checking it out. Please, uh, if, if you haven't yet, um, subscribe, it really helps me out a lot. Um, you know, and, and, uh, yeah, I'd love to, you know, get a partnership with YouTube. So Anyway, uh, that is it for now. Thank you so much. Take care of yourselves. I will see you next week. Bye-bye.